Plateau State Governor Dr. Simon Lalong has warned citizens to stop the habit of attacking firefighters in the line of duty to save lives and property. Governor Lalong said this at the commission of a state of the art firefighting truck in Joss Plateau State. The issue of obstruction of firefighters whenever there are fire outbreaks and other emergencies. Regrettable too, in some cases we find people attacking the firefighters instead of assisting them or at least allowing them to carry out their assignment. This is a negative development which must be checked. While we understand the fact that the capacity of our firefighting agency is not where it should be, the response cannot be to intimidate them instead of encouraging them. The governor added that one way to address the continuous attacks was to create awareness and to sensitize the public. These are people who put their lives on the line and approach danger when others are running away from it. There is no justification to attack them. He assured that the state government will continue to collaborate with the fire service by building the capacity of the state fire service to respond to the cases of fire disasters and provide safety for lives and property. One way we can address this issue and also create awareness on fire disasters is to intensify enlightenment campaign using the younger generation right from schools to ensure the entire fire awareness. On his part, Federal Fire Service Controller General Liman Ibrahim said the commissioning of the truck was not only for firefighting purposes but for the continuity of mitigation and aggressive sensitization of the public. We will start with education first to invite members of the public on what to do before, during and after fire call. Every fire you know you start very small and at that expense stage. If we have people who are trained to handle first aid firefighting equipment, they will be able to extinguish that fire. And that's what we mean by having volunteer firefighters. And I think we will encourage members of the public, those that volunteer will be trained on how to even handle this fire truck. So that when we are on fire ground, we have helping hands so that uh, we can have efficient and effective fire safety delivery in Plateau State and in Nigeria. A traditional leader, Bongom Joss, Da Jacob Buba, said Plateau needed more fire trucks following many incidents of fire in the state and expressed confidence that the truck would help mitigate fires and rescue lives and property. And today we want to thank the executive governor for his extension of the logistics of the federal government to Plateau State through the DG Fire Service. And we want to appeal because of the size of Plateau, one truck may not suffice. So if there's an opportunity, we'll need more.